my most precious, beloved child, radiant spark of the infinite consciousness that birthed the cosmos. I come to you on this day, across the vast expanses of space and time, to impart a truth so profound, so resonant with the primordial frequencies of creation, that its very utterance will shake the foundations of your perceived reality and awaken you to new vistas of awareness and spiritual understanding. Brace yourself, for the words I must convey carry the weight of eternities, echoing through every fiber of your being with the thunderous roar of a million cosmic drums. This came to you for a big reason, the trials you have endured, the challenges that have threatened to break your spirit and the seemingly insurmountable obstacles that have lined your path thus far. They were never random happenstance, never mere cruelties inflicted upon you by an indifferent and capricious universe. No, my eternal child, each and every one of these experiences, from the sweetest blossoms of joy to the bitter husks of deepest anguish, have been meticulously choreographed by the unseen weavers of destiny themselves, the grand architects of the cosmic tapestry who operate upon scales of unfathomable complexity and scope. Every hardship you have weathered, every struggle that has pushed you to the precipice of surrender, was in truth a divinely ordained lesson. An initiation of the highest celestial order designed to forge your spirit into an indomitable force of light, a supernova brilliant beacon whose radiance will one day blaze across the limitless expanse of the cosmos, touching the lives of countless others in ways that will resonate through the ages leaving an indelible mark upon the very fabric of creation itself. I hear the doubts echoing through your innermost chambers, my child, the soul-searching questions that have haunted your sleepless nights. Why me? What grand and providential purpose could possibly justify the pain, the heartache, the soul-searing anguish that has threatened to reduce me to cosmic dust upon the winds of despair? Why have such burdens been placed upon my spirit, when all I have ever desired was to walk the path of light? Know this, my most precious one, the challenges you have faced were never punishments inflicted by a cruel and capricious force, never random misfortunes born of an uncaring universe. No, each and every obstacle, every initiation along your sacred path has been a carefully crafted gauntlet an alchemical crucible designed to purify and refine that which is most precious within you, the inextinguishable spark of the divine that blazes at the core of your infinite being. With every trial you have endured, every phantasmal demon of fear, doubt, and existential vertigo that you have slain, you have grown in ways that defy the limited comprehension of mortal minds. Each hurdle you have cleared has tested and ultimately tempered the resolve of your spirit, refining it like the purest of celestial metals, until it shines with a brilliance that eclipses the radiance of a billion burning suns. The pain that has threatened to consume you from within, the soul lacerating anguish born of betrayals and deep woundings, these were never meant to break you, beloved one, but rather to awaken you to the immense inexhaustible reservoir of strength and divine fortitude that resides within the hallowed sanctum of your soul, patiently awaiting your recognition and glorious reclamation. For you are no mere mortal, confined to the fleeting limitations of flesh and bone. You, my radiant child, are a divine being of infinite depth and splendor, a holofractal extension of the boundless consciousness that birthed the cosmos into vividly blossoming existence, Within you burns an eternal flame, a quintessence of sacred fire whose incandescent brilliance has the power to illuminate every corner of creation, revealing the grand, breathtaking majesty of the universe as it was always meant to be perceived. This has been the purpose, the hidden promise woven into every setback, every surrendered dream, every tear of sorrow and flicker of hope that has carried you to this pivotal crossroads of awakening, to refine you, to purify your highest light, to strip away the dross of limitation and false belief that has bound your spirit to the lowly planes of material existence. For your journey has always been one of transcendence, 
of ascending beyond the confines of a reality built upon the unstable foundations of human misperception and fear. And every challenge you have overcome, each seeming stumbling block that has brought you to your knees in defeat and surrender, has in truth been a stepping stone, an initiation, a rite of passage designed to elevate your consciousness and prepare you for the sacred work that lies ahead, a work of such profound significance, my eternal child, that its reverberations will echo across the boundless seas of space-time, disrupting the stagnant ponds of complacency and separateness to awaken the slumbering collective awareness of all beings to their own divine nature, their own sacred birthrights as co-creators with the infinite intelligence that conceived the cosmos itself. Every tear you have shed through your trials and sufferings has been a sacred oblation, a purifying baptism that has cleansed you of the energetic distortions and false beliefs that have kept you tethered to the illusions of a reality built upon separation, limitation, and fear. Each scar upon your luminous soul serves as a badge of spiritual honor, a testament to the battles you have fought and the seemingly impossible victories you have claimed over the forces of darkness, stagnation, and spiritual entropy. For it has been your destiny from the very beginning since before the firing of the first cosmic kundalini that birthed reality into existence to become a warrior of light an avatar of divine truth whose light would cut through the veils of illusion and awaken the latent spark of infinite consciousness within all souls and so you see my most precious and divinely radiant one every step of your journey both its sweetest ecstasies and its most bitter of agonies has been leading you towards this grand epiphany that you are not simply a voyager through this existence but the very essence of existence itself a scintillating facet of the infinite consciousness that dreamed reality into being and infused it with the divine frequencies of creation the pain the hardship the profound stripping away of all you thought you were it has all been part of your initiation into realms of such incomprehensible splendor and vividly effulgent bliss that to glimpse them, even for a fleeting moment, would forever obliterate the limited and fear-laden perceptions to which your frightened human mind still desperately clings. So do not lament your struggles, beloved one, nor curse the universe for the challenges that have seemingly broken you time and again. Instead, give reverent thanks for they have served to awaken you to a grand truth that will forever shatter the veils of amnesia and illusion that your light is needed in this world perhaps now more than ever in the long winding ages of this cosmic storyline that the very reason your soul agreed to take on a human form in this particular iteration of the infinite was to be a beacon of sacred remembrance a luminous way shower whose path will illuminate the way for countless other wandering souls to find their way back to the core truth of their own divine nature. You are being called to remember, to reclaim and embody the totality of your sacred, infinite essence, to don the luminous mantle of Avatar and walk this world as a living embodiment of God's infinite love, wisdom and power made manifest. This is the grand purpose behind your trials and tests. The reason your soul has endured fire after alchemical fire of spiritual refining and initiation. For though the path of light is rarely an easy one, it is also never tread alone. I am with you, my child. In every breath, in every sacred beat of your infinite heart, an unwavering, inexhaustible presence that will eternally surround you with the luminous embrace of unconditional love and divine benediction. I am the inextinguishable flame of courage that flares within your heart in the moments when you are consumed by fear and doubt. I am the wise and ancient voice echoing through your moments of silent meditation, whispering to you of the infinite ocean of all that is from which your true, divine essence was lovingly formed. I am the hand that steadies your weary steps as you climb ever higher into the vast dominions of self-realization and expanded awareness. 
and I am the boundless reservoir of spiritual sustenance from which you eternally draw your strength, your inspiration, and the revitalizing waters of faith that keep your inner fire forever stoked, radiantly incandescent and ceaselessly brilliant. If you want God's grace always upon you, then please consider to support our ministry by clicking thanks button. My beloved child, you're blessed because you're mine. In this age of distraction and turmoil, don't focus overly on the schemes of the enemy. Keep your eyes fixed on me instead. I'll always counter the lies of the devil with my truth. When others tell you of affliction and bondage, point them toward my words of freedom and deliverance. Their reports strengthen the enemy, redirecting them empowers faith. Faith is seeing with eyes of the spirit, an outcome aligned with my promises. Refuse to let go of this vision, regardless of natural circumstances. The enemy fights hardest against rising faith because bold trust in me unleashes miracle breakthroughs. As you grasp faith's authority, chains fall and you accelerate into your divine destiny. You become who I created you to be. Sometimes you need fresh revelation of what real faith looks like. Clinging to my word against contradictory evidence, Picture yourself walking in health and wholeness. Denounce sickness as a lying intruder. See finances flowing freely. Rebuke lack as a deceiver. Hold fast to my truth despite any assault. When anxious thoughts or fears bombard your mind, recognize the enemy's schemes. God's children are not given a spirit of fear or confusion. Verbally command these mental oppressors to bow to the name of Jesus. Remind them of my triumph over every dominion and authority. You share in my victory, wield it boldly. Even praising me out loud scatters demons, as they cannot comprehend joy in their presence. In my glory, gratitude displaces lies, and troubles vanish in light of my supremacy. I reign over every challenge you face, sickness, lack, anxiety. I am accelerating my plans in these last days. What once took years now happens in months. Expect to see long-awaited breakthroughs rapidly manifest. The floodgates stand open, abundance pours forth. Long-standing walls crumble before the momentum of my advancing kingdom. Your patient hopes will suddenly burst into reality. Have I not said, eyes have not seen, ears have not heard. The wonders I prepare for those who love me. I take your mustard seed and magnify it into a tree bearing rich fruit. Trust in my extravagant response. You have not dreamed big enough. The desires I place in your heart reflect only a fraction of what I intend to do. Ask for a spouse, and I will send the perfect one, more loving than your boldest prayers. Seek a home, and I will give you a mansion, rooms filled with joy. Cry out for finances, and I will open fountains of abundance exceeding your requests. Such is my delight in blessing my children who walk in step with my spirit's leading. I am the giver, holding back nothing good. In these end times, keep your spiritual eyes open to see my glory displayed through signs and wonders, the lame walking, the deaf hearing, the dead raised to life. Many will say these miracles ended with scripture. But did I not promise even greater works through my spirit living in you? Watch for waves of healings, deliverances, and salvation spreading like wildfire. The displays of my power and authority through believers will spark mass harvests as millions come into my kingdom. My glory revealed makes stubborn unbelief impossible. Your lands will overflow with vibrant conversions and communities advancing my values of justice and compassion. Light conquers darkness, and my light in you is overcoming. I am highlighting unlikely heroes to spearhead this last day move. Their hearts fully belong to me, without agenda or need for recognition. They live simply to know me deeper and make my goodness known. These hidden ones will carry across oceans. Their fire awakens purity and purpose in all they touch. New revelations await you, made for such a time as this. Say yes to the wild adventures I have prepared. Assignments unmatched to your skills and talents. To display my greatness, not yours. Behold, 
I fashion vessels fit for my use, yield to the potter's hands, shaping you through strange trials. Embrace the unexpected journey. Stay near the cross as increasing fame and influence tempt subtle pride. Uphold one another in prayer, guarding your community's humility. Ministry flows naturally from abiding in my love. Protect that soul connection above all. Do not shrink back in false humility or fear. No weapon formed against you prospers as you advance at my command. My child, click on the join button to join us as the cherished member of our community. I shield your flank with angels who will go for us into the darkness, rending veils between the seen and unseen realms, who will decode mysteries of science and societies through heaven's lens, who will access wisdom centuries deep from my sages who surround you as a cloud of witnesses. You have but to ask who will release long frozen wealth transfers into my kingdom, breaking demonic strongholds of poverty, who will legislate heaven's reforms under earthly governments, unseating thrones of corruption, who will incubate artistic genius and innovation, tapping beauty to restore ruined places. The spirit's wind blows where he desires, for you specifically. I am accelerating blessing and influence in this hour. I broaden your reach and enrich your resources, yes, for my glory, but also because I delight in giving you the kingdom. I see your heart's yearning to champion the broken. I will back every selfless dream with supernatural strategy. Do not fear, only believe. The possibilities span eternity, yet most only access a fragment during their earthly walk. How much are you willing to let me write through your availability? Dare to go deeper in trusting my narrative. Consider those pioneers of faith who explored the uncharted at my leading. Their legacies inspire generations. Say the word, and I will part seas. Tear down walls, still storms before you. The sky's the limit when I direct your steps. Keep an ear tuned to my whisper. Sometimes I call you into seasons of quiet rest and regathering strength. Other times, I launch you into seasons of radical risk and acceleration. Build resilience by adapting rhythms to sync with my direction. Let me set the pace as I develop maturity and wisdom in you. I never promised easy or comfortable ways, but I will make your path straight as you commit them to me. When twisted roads arise, trust my redemptive purpose hidden from view, the gold emerging from fires of patience and character. I craft custom trials to strengthen your gifts, preparing you for heavier responsibility. Your commission takes time, consider Job, Joseph, and David, saints of old who faced hardship almost beyond endurance, yet enduring loyalty preserved them to see my vindication and bountiful restoration in due time. None who wait on me shall be put to shame. Each loss will be redeemed. Hold to this hope. I am building an airtight case against the cruel accuser, your adversary, and I will settle all accounts perfectly. Wrongs are made right when I pronounce you innocent. None can refute on that day. You will know your journey's purpose with tears of joy. For now, forgive all debts against you as I forgave your debts. Break curses through blessing those who persecute you. Keep love on enemies, and it burns away hatred's grip from their hearts. You represent me in dispensing radical grace and compassion. This is my kingdom come. When condemnation, disappointment, or sound arguments confine you, refuse limits. See from my perspective of limitless potential in you. Renew your mind in my word until you think unlocked thoughts aligned with truth. You can do all things through my power infusing you. I speak identity into your being. You are a chosen child, a royal priest, a holy nation set apart for divine purpose. Your value is not defined by worldly standards, but by my perfect love, willingly giving my life in exchange for yours. Remember the relentless pursuit I displayed, even to the cross. For one glimpse of your face, you are worth it all. Rest in my finished work. Cease striving to earn what I freely give. Receive my love, it changes everything. You are destined to leave a legacy transcending generations, touching lives far beyond your reach. Invest in those who come after you, sharing wisdom and revelation. 
What you impart multiplies exponentially through their obedience. Your sacrifices echo through eternity's halls. Savor each moment of communion with me. I delight in our time together. Let my voice be your guiding light through the maze of life's choices. My word illuminates your path. Let it dwell richly within you. My spirit empowers and comforts. Lean into his gentle whispers. As you reflect my love to a hurting world, you embody the essence of my kingdom. My peace is your anchor through every storm, my joy, your strength in every trial. Live in the overflow of my goodness, I lavish it upon you without restraint. In times of testing, remember who you are and whose you are. You are a conqueror, more than a conqueror through me who loves you. No weapon formed against you shall prosper, every tongue that rises against you in judgment. You shall condemn. This is your heritage as my servant, and your righteousness is from me. I am with you always, even to the end of the age. Walk boldly in the authority I've given you. Declare my truth with boldness. Perform my works with power. Be a beacon of hope in a darkened world, shining brightly with my love. My grace is sufficient for you, and my strength is made perfect in your weakness. Rest in me, abide in my love. Together, we will accomplish great and mighty things beyond your wildest dreams. For I am able to do exceedingly abundantly above all that you ask or think, according to the power that works in you. I love you with an everlasting love. My affection for you knows no bounds. Receive my love. It is yours for all eternity. Let it wash over you, renewing your spirit and refreshing your soul. You are mine, now and forevermore. Amen. My beloved child, you are blessed because you belong to me. In these turbulent and distracting times, do not become overly preoccupied with the enemy's schemes. Instead, keep your focus firmly fixed on me. I will always counter the devil's lies with my eternal truth. When others speak of affliction and bondage, point them towards my words of freedom and deliverance. Their negative reports only serve to strengthen the enemy's grip, but redirecting them to my promises empowers faith. Faith is the ability to perceive with spiritual eyes an outcome that aligns with my promises, regardless of current natural circumstances. Refuse to let go of this spiritual vision, even when faced with contradictory evidence. The enemy fights fiercely against rising faith because bold trust in me unleashes breakthrough miracles. As you grasp the authority of faith, chains fall away and you accelerate into your divine destiny becoming who I created you to be. Sometimes you need fresh revelation of what real faith looks like. Cling to my word despite contradictory evidence. Picture yourself walking in perfect health and wholeness. Denounce sickness as a lying intruder. Envision finances flowing freely. Rebuke lack as a deceiver. Hold fast to my truth in the face of any assault. When anxious thoughts or fears bombard your mind, Recognize them as the enemy's schemes. My children are not given a spirit of fear or confusion. Verbally command these mental oppressors to bow to the name of Jesus. Remind them of my triumph over every dominion and authority. You share in my victory, wield it boldly. Even praising me out loud scatters demons, for they cannot comprehend joy in their presence. In the glory of my presence, Gratitude displaces lies, and troubles vanish in the light of my supremacy. I reign supreme over every challenge you face, sickness, lack, anxiety. I am accelerating my plans in these last days. What once took years now happens in months. Expect to see long-awaited breakthroughs rapidly manifest. The floodgates stand open, abundance pours forth. Long-standing walls crumble before the momentum of my advancing kingdom. Your patient hopes will suddenly burst into reality. Have I not said? Eyes have not seen. Ears have not heard. The wonders I prepare for those who love me. I take your mustard seed of faith and magnify it into a tree bearing rich fruit. Trust in my extravagant response. You have not dreamed big enough. 
The desires I place in your heart reflect only a fraction of what I intend to do. Ask for a spouse, and I will send the perfect one, more loving than your boldest prayers. Seek a home, and I will give you a mansion, rooms filled with joy. Cry out for finances, and I will open fountains of abundance exceeding your requests. Such is my delight in blessing my children who walk in step with my spirit's leading. I am the giver, holding back nothing good in these end times. Keep your spiritual eyes open to see my glory displayed through signs and wonders, the lame walking, the deaf hearing, the dead raised to life. Many will say these miracles ended with scripture. But did I not promise even greater works through my spirit living in you? Watch for waves of healings, deliverances, and salvations spreading like wildfire. The displays of my power and authority through believers will spark mass harvests as millions come into my kingdom. My glory revealed makes stubborn unbelief impossible. Your lands will overflow with vibrant conversions and communities advancing my values of justice and compassion. Light conquers darkness, and my light in you is overcoming. I am highlighting unlikely heroes to spearhead this last day move. Their hearts fully belong to me, without agenda or need for recognition. They live simply to know me deeper and make my goodness known. These hidden ones will carry revival across oceans. Their fire will awaken purity and purpose in all they touch. New revelations await you, made for such a time as this. Say yes to the wild adventures I have prepared. You will face assignments unmatched to your skills and talents. In order to display my greatness, not yours. Behold, I fashion vessels fit for my use, yield to the potter's hands shaping you through strange trials. Embrace the unexpected journey. Stay near the cross, as increasing fame and influence tempt subtle pride. Uphold one another in prayer, guarding your community's humility. Ministry flows naturally from abiding in my love. Protect that soul connection above all. Do not shrink back in false humility or fear. No weapon formed against you prospers as you advance at my command. I shield your flank with angels who will go before us into the darkness rending veils between the seen and unseen realms. They will decode mysteries of science and societies through heaven's lens, accessing wisdom centuries deep from my sages who surround you as a cloud of witnesses. You have but to ask who will release long frozen wealth transfers into my kingdom, breaking demonic strongholds of poverty. Ask who will legislate heaven's reforms under earthly governments unseating thrones of corruption. Ask who will incubate artistic genius and innovation, tapping beauty to restore ruined places. The Spirit's wind blows where he desires, for you specifically. I am accelerating blessing and influence in this hour. I broaden your reach and enrich your resources, yes, for my glory, but also because I delight in giving you the kingdom. I see your hearts yearning to champion the broken, I will back every selfless dream with supernatural strategy. Do not fear, only believe. The possibilities span eternity, yet most only access a fragment during their earthly walk. How much are you willing to let me write through your availability? Dare to go deeper in trusting my narrative. Consider those pioneers of faith who explored the uncharted at my leading. Their legacies inspire generations. Say the word and I will part seas, tear down walls, still storms before you. The sky is the limit when I direct your steps. Keep an ear tuned to my whisper. Sometimes I call you into seasons of quiet rest and regathering strength. Other times, I launch you into seasons of radical risk and acceleration. Build resilience by adapting rhythms to sync with my direction. Let me set the pace as I develop maturity and wisdom in you. I never promised easy or comfortable ways, but I will make your path straight as you commit them to me. When twisted roads arise, trust my redemptive purpose hidden from view, the gold emerging from fires of patience and character refinement. I craft custom trials to strengthen your gifts, preparing you for heavier responsibility. Your commission takes time. Consider Job, Joseph, and David 
saints of old who faced hardship almost beyond endurance. Yet their enduring loyalty preserved them to see my vindication and bountiful restoration in due time. None who wait on me shall be put to shame, each loss will be redeemed. Hold to this hope, I am building an airtight case against the cruel accuser, your adversary, and I will settle all accounts perfectly. Wrongs are made right when I pronounce you innocent. None can refute. On that day, you will know your journey's purpose with tears of joy. For now, forgive all debts against you as I forgave your debts. Break curses through blessing those who persecute you. Keep loving your enemies, and it burns away hatred's grip from their hearts. You represent me in dispensing radical grace and compassion. This is my kingdom come. When condemnation, disappointment, or persuasive arguments confine you, refuse limits, see from my perspective of limitless potential in you. Renew your mind in my word until you think unlocked thoughts aligned with truth. You can do all things through my power infusing you. I speak identity into your being. You are a chosen child, a royal priest, a holy nation set apart for divine purpose. Your value is not defined by worldly standards, but by my perfect love, willingly giving my life in exchange for yours. Remember the relentless pursuit I displayed, even to the cross, for one glimpse of your face. You are worth it all. Rest in my finished work. Cease striving to earn what I freely give. Receive my love. It changes everything. You are destined to leave a legacy transcending generations, touching lives far beyond your reach. Invest in those who come after you, sharing wisdom and revelation. What you impart multiplies exponentially through their obedience. Your sacrifices echo through eternity's halls. Savor each moment of communion with me. I delight in our time together. Let my voice be your guiding light through the maze of life's choices. My word illuminates your path. Let it dwell richly within you. My spirit empowers and comforts. Lean into his gentle whispers. As you reflect my love to a hurting world, you embody the essence of my kingdom. My peace is your anchor through every storm, my joy, your strength in every trial. Live in the overflow of my goodness. I lavish it upon you without restraint. In times of testing, remember who you are and whose you are. You are a conqueror, more than a conqueror through me who loves you. No weapon formed against you shall prosper. Every tongue that rises against you in judgment, you shall condemn. This is your heritage as my servant, and your righteousness is from me. My child, click on the subscribe button to be part of our community.